welcome to the end zone. Let's move the chains. You know, it's unfortunate, you know, breaking news that Jared Goff has a broken right thumb. Uh, got it today versus the Seahawks. So unfortunate news if you're a Rams fan. But with injuries in sports, it brings opportunities for other guys to showcase what they've got. And that brings up the backup quarterback for the LA Rams, who's likely going to get the start this weekend, an upcoming game, former Alliance of American Football star, John Wolford. They're going to be hosting the Arizona Cardinals. So a pivotal matchup, playoff hopes on the line, really. They basically, this is a must-win game for the LA Rams to earn a playoff berth. They could also use a loss from the Chicago Bears. But this matchup is kind of fitting if you think about it because John Wolford played for the Arizona Hotshots in the Alliance of American Football, balled out, coached by Rick Neuheisel. Now, if Goff gets surgery, like I said, this might be a season-ending injury and he might be done for the year. So if they make it to the playoffs, John Wolford might be the guy who will get playoff starts, which is crazy to think about being put in this situation. Uh, in the Alliance of American Football, you want to find out a little bit about Walford. Uh, he had a 1,617 yards, 14 touchdowns, 7 picks. He got better as the season progressed. He's undersized at 6'1", 199 pounds. May have changed ever since he got into the NFL, but that's the last uh, recorded height and weight I have for him. Now, in the Alliance of American Football, he was able to showcase his arm talent. He was a great deep ball passer and incredibly accurate. Like, this is a guy who is a baller. He can do a lot of things, and he was very successful in the AAF. He also has the ability to use his legs. He doesn't look like he's the most athletic guy out there, but he can really extend plays and even pick up some first downs. He had some incredible runs in the Alliance. He also throws really well on the run. So he, he this, this dude's an athlete. He's a gamer. And I'm really excited to see how he fares against the Arizona Cardinals. He's the second Alliance of American football quarterback to get a start this season. Garrett Gilbert got one with the Dallas Cowboys, almost beat the Steelers. And he's the fourth spring football quarterback along with Taylor Heineke, who got play action today with the Washington football team, and P.J. Walker with the Carolina Panthers to see the field. Walker got a start. Heineke, we'll see what happens with that situation with Dwayne Haskins, the quarterback room, in the Washington football team situation. But this just shows how important spring football is, developing players. You know, if two leagues already have these quarterbacks going and taking these backup positions, you know, that means that something is working with spring football and that it's very important. And John Wolford gets his opportunity to get a first start in an incredibly important game. And possibly, if he can win, if he can show people what's up with the LA Rams, he could be playing in the NFL playoffs. Imagine that. Thanks for watching The End Zone. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment so we can move the chains. Thank you.